the gas divergence theorem so there is a relation between the double integral and the volume integral right so if f is a closed surface enclosing a region of space with volume v and f is a vector point function with continuous first order partial derivatives in v the integral over s uh, double integral over s f vector dot n cap ds equal to triple integral over v divergence of f into dx dy dz so this is a statement of gas divergence theorem right verify gas divergence theorem for f vector equal to x squared i plus y squared j plus z squared k where s is the surface of the cuboid so parallel of reporting cuboid again a difference so parallel reporting la oru idu vandu open a irukku inga vandu na ellame close so that's why we call it as cuboid formed by the planes x equal to 0 y equal to 0 y equal to b x equal to z equal to 0 and z equal to c so stokes theorem ku idhukku enna difference appadina stokes theorem la oru surface endu open la irukum inga vandu all the six surfaces are Close one. So, how like this? So wide. So I get that. So J get that. K get that. So right. राइट हैंड साइड सो डाइवर्जेंस ऑफ एफ सो डाइवर्जेंस ऑफ एफ ना ना डेल डॉट एफ व्हाट इस डेल डॉट एफ सो डो बाय डो एक्स प्लस जे इनटू डो बाय डो वाई प्लस के इनटू डो बाय डो इज इट आह डॉट एफ फैक्टर सो एक्स क्वार्ट आई Plus y squared j plus z squared k. So dot product only na. Do by do x of this. So 2x plus 2y plus 2z. So 2 into x plus y plus z. Right? And then take the right hand side. So triple integral over b. So derivative of dx dy dz equals so triple integral 0 to c 0 to b and 0 to a 2 into x plus y plus z into dx dy dz right so 2 into 0 to c 0 to b so x squared by 2 plus y plus z into x so 0 to a dy dz so a substitute pond in a so 2 into 0 to c 0 to b a squared by 2 plus a into y plus z dy dz so integrate with respect to y so 2 into 0 to c a squared y by 2 plus a y squared by 2 plus a is it into y so 0 to b into d is it so 2 into integral 0 to c for now going a squared b by 2 plus a b squared by 2 Then plus a b into z into d z. 
right? Log of such a point is zero. So again, integrate. So two times. So a square b by two into z plus a b square by two into z plus a b into z square by two. So zero to c. So two into a square b c by two. Plus a b square c by two, plus a b c square by two. Can take a b c outside by two. So a b c into a plus b plus c. Take it as this equation number one, right? Then the left hand side. So you take this equation number one. So the left hand side is uh, double integral over s uh, f dot n cap d s. So you have S is the surface. You have six surfaces. So our S1, S2, S3, S4, S5, plus S6. F dot n cap this. You form this table. So S1 x equal to zero, S2 x equal to a, S3 y equal to zero, S4 y equal to b, S5 z equal to zero, and S6 z equal to c. Then n cap. So minus i vector plus i vector minus j plus j minus k plus k. And the effect of dot n cap. Effect is this: dot n cap by now minus x square plus x square minus y square plus y square minus z square plus z square. Right? Then ds. So this is an y z plane. So dy dz, dy dz, and this is an y x z plane. dx dz dx dz and this one is an xy plane dx dy right so on s1 so w and w over s1 f dot n cap ds and this is minus x square So x equal to zero. We need to know zero. Zero. It is a square. This is zero. This is b square. This is zero. And this is c square. Now x equal to zero. Let substitute for now zero. So this is zero dy dz. So this is equal to zero. And s two. A vector dot n cap d s equal. S two k a square d y d z so zero to b and zero to c so a square into y zero to b d z so a square b into we integrate upon z zero to c so a square b c on s three Double integral over s3 effect of dot n cap ds equal to zero f dot n cap into zero. So on s4, uh, on s4 is b square dx dy. Sorry, dx dz. So x varies from zero to a, and z varies from zero to c. So b squared into x zero to a into d z. So a b squared zero to c d z. So a b squared into z zero to c. So a b squared c. Right? On s five. Equal 
equal to 0. Yeah, S5 and the 0. And S6. C square dx dy. So x varies from 0 to a and y varies from 0 to b. So c square 0 to b x into 0 to a dy. So a c square so a c square b. But therefore double integral over s f factor dot and cap ds equal to 0 plus a square b c plus 0 plus a b square c plus 0 plus a c square b. So you can take a b c outside a plus b plus c. So from 1 and 2 average this theorem verify double integral over s f factor dot n cap d s equal to triple integral over v divergence of f d v. So verify gauss divergence theorem for f factor equal to 4x is at i minus y square j plus y is at k when s is the closed surface of the cube formed by this surface is x equal to 0, x equal to 1, y equal to 0, y equal to 1, z equal to 0 and z equal to 1. So here is a cube x axis, y axis, z axis. statement w into global s f factor dot n cap ds equal to w into global v divergence of f dv what is divergence of f so del dot f is equal to so dou by dou x of this so 4 is it and dou by dou of this so minus 2y dou by dou is at of this, so plus y. So I get 4 is at minus y. Then triple integral over v, dive f dv equal to, so limit element again, 0 to 1 now. x varies from 0 to 1, y varies from 0 to 1, z varies from 0 to 1. So 4 is at minus y. dx dy dz. So 0 to 1, 0 to 1 is integrate point na minus y into x, 0 to 1 dy dz. So this is equal to 4z minus y into dy dz. So 0 to 1, 4z into y minus y squared by 2. So 0 to 1, 4 is it minus 1 by 2 into dz. So 4 is it squared by 2 minus z by 2. So 4 by 2 minus 1 by 2. Yeah. This is equal to 3 by 2. Call it as equation number 1. Now the left hand side, double integral over s, f dot and cap t s. So yes, we have a 6 surfaces. Then you form the table. So 
So x equal to 0, x equal to 1, y equal to 0, y equal to 1, z equal to 0, z equal to 1. Minus i, i minus j plus j minus k plus k. F dot and cap. So this is an F factor. So minus 4 x is z. So x is 0. So which is equal to 0. Then plus 4 x is z. Which is equal to 4 z. Then here. Plus y square. So which is equal to 0. Then minus y square. So which is equal to minus 1. Then. Uh, minus y z which is equal to 0 and plus y z plus equal to y then ds here uh, y z plane so dy dz dy dz so this is an x z dx dz dx dz and this one is uh, x y dx dy so on surfaces, uh, say S1, S2, S3, S4, S5, S6. So these are 0, right? So S1 is 0, then S3 is 0, then S5 is 0. We so simply have to calculate S2, S4 and S6. So on S2, so W and W over S2, F factor dot and cap DS. So, limit is 0 to 1. What is 4 is it? dy dz. So, 0 to 1, 4 is it into y, 0 to 1 dz. So, 0 to 1, 4 is it dz. So, 4 is it squared by 2. What are the 4 into 1 by 2 is equal to on S4, double integral over S4, F factor dot n cap ds. So 0 to 1, 0 to 1, S4, minus 1, dx, dz. And minus 1 into 0 to 1, x, 0 to 1, dz. minus 1. So on S6, F factor dot n cap ds equal to 0 to 1, 0 to 1, y dx dy. So 0 to 1, y into x. So 0 to 1, y dy. So, y squared by 2, 0 to 1. So, 1 by 2, right? So, therefore, double integral over S, F factor dot n cap ds. So, S1 is 0, so S2 is 2, S3 is 0, then S4 is uh, minus 1, S5 0, S6 is 1 by 2. So 2 minus 1, 1, 1 plus 1 by 2, this is equal to 3 by 2. So from 1 and 2, the divergence is zero by 5. What is that? W integral over S, F factor dot n cap ds equal to 2 integral over V, divergence of F, D. Right?